Hey sweeties welcome to my another video. And the final move. Yay, they won. He won. You all started to join by cheering for them. My eyes are glued on him. The captain of the basketball team. I quickly ran to him, giving him the bottle of fresh orange juice, just like his favorite. He smiled before taking it from me. I turned my head then ran from them before he could stop me. Your boy. Stop staring at her. She left already and gave me this juice. He said, earning a scoff from the younger one, but he refused to give him the bottle. I, I wasn't staring, okay? She sighed, my dear, as other girls are. Besides, if you don't have an admirer who gives you stuff like mine, that doesn't mean I'll share it with you. Was she just an admirer to him? Why not? Where are you going to confess to that guy, huh? You know how popular he is. Every girl, of course, except me, though, is after him. Get your men before anyone does. Right. Plus, I've heard that there's new Gaganagawa. Well, my dad is the principal here, so I don't want him to see that girl. She's beyond beautiful. Shut up. You're the prettiest girl I've ever seen. If I was a boy or a lesbian, I would stick to you until you accept me. I stop being insecure and go to him. I will. Today. Oh, hey Ryan, you asked me to meet you here. After the confession, I hope you understand my situation. We can be friends, and then we can be. No, I cut him off. That's good of you. But you don't have to feel pity on me. Um, I'll take my leave now. I tried to sound strong that I ain't hurt. Girl, how old are I when my first in a long time crush just rejected me? Next day. I was obviously crying all the night. But I felt relieved knowing that we can be friends and I can make him fall in love with me. Still, I got rejected, you know, so it was kind of hard to fall asleep. I can't wait to see him. As I was looking my locker after grabbing the book, I saw a huge crowd among with those popular seven boys of our school. Jungkook is one of them. Wonder where is he? I peeked through the crowd only to break my heart into a million places. Jungkook's arm was wrapped around a girl's waist. Crap, she's the new girl I was talking about. The girl pecked his shake. They were laughing, smiling. He seemed really close to that girl. He seemed very happy. I don't want to break down here. My eyes met with his. He smiled at me. Really, he didn't feel anything towards me. Then I just a random girl to him. I broke the eye contact and left from there. Was I crying? Absolutely. Fine. He whispered yelled. But she was already gone from there. She seemed hurt. Badly hurt. But he couldn't understand why she reacted that way. I saw Hain entering the classroom with the eyes. Did I really hurt her yesterday? I was waiting for her to look at me, but without sparing a glance, she went towards another seat. 
like she usually sits somewhere around me like close to me today she sat far from me i can only look at her face since her back is facing me why i said we can be friends but she's ignoring me my mind was thinking about her eyes still glued on her hoping she will turn back and will smile at me my thoughts get interrupted by a girl's voice calling out my name somi i didn't look at him freeman runs it's hard for me to avoid him more after he said we can be friends but does he care i don't think so if he does he wouldn't be showing around with that new girl as i say in her name she entered the classroom obviously she will go and sit with him i don't care okay hey i'm somi can i sit here i got startled and shocked and surprised at the same time she literally came to sit next to me instead of him it's not like i own it so you can sit i was too rude she snatched my name anyway i can start on doing my work i never have been rude to anyone and it's it's needed oh hey i don't have any friends so would you be my friend she asked so politely i wanted to say no but i couldn't why not i mean i said extending hand to shake it's lunch time come on vaini show me the cafeteria i'm so hungry she win it's been some hours i met her but we came so close winning like okay let's go i said and stood up after picking my stuff as i was about to walk away that someone interrupted and that someone is none other than Hey, Ryan. So me, let's go and grab lunch. Yes, Oppa. I'm so hungry. Oppa, what the? Never mind. Let's go, Annie. I thought you were alone. That's why I said yes to come to cafeteria, but I have work. I have to meet my dad, so you guys can carry on. I said and left without sparing glance at him. No. Ah, oh. what's wrong with the oppa? She asked, but he was so busy to looking at the girl, just dished his offer and left. Days have passed. I'm still ignoring him when I'm friends with Somi. Sometimes I feel so weird like she is even dating him or what? Like she doesn't even act like if she is dating him. I don't care, okay? Fine. Just stop thinking about him. But I feel bad whenever I've known his presence. I seem upset. But why should he? Ryan sleep you have to go to Somi's home the girl she needs my help with her assignments and notes I knocked on the door expecting Somi to open the door but to my shock it was him again Hey, Ryan. Wait, where are you going? I started walking far from him. Maybe I came in wrong house. He stood across me. Because I came in wrong address. Now give me there. I said I wanted to leave ASAP, but he again stopped. But this time, pulling me closer. Do you know the reason behind your ignorance towards me?
I told him to let go of me. Not until you give me the proper Indian expression. Hmm. Now you got your answer. Now let me go. Mommy, wait me for me. I was surprised by a girl screaming their voice coming behind me from inside the house. OMG, I was waiting for you. Come inside the house. Not again. My heart can't take this shit anymore. So now she's freaking living with you? It finally hurt. Is this why she will live with you? Where else she would go when it's her own home? It's okay. Just let me go. I felt my shoulders hands off my feet. What's wrong with you? Now can't my sister stay with me? You'll be jealous of her too, huh? He said smirking. She's Joan Sony. My sister. The only the girl whose name going to be Joan by me is you. I love you too. I wanted to prank you since my sister was transferring here. I wanted to make you jealous. The day proposed me was the best day of my life. So your stupid decided to make me jealous? That's why you said we can be friends. Seriously Joan? I cried so much because of this. I'm sorry baby it didn't turn out as I thought. You ignored me. And I cried too okay so it's equal. Oh my baby cried. But I cried more okay. I'm sorry baby. I promise I won't ever make you cry. Unless. The end thank you for watching.